gonna make you think something that he what he's not mm -hmm. you know that's it it's very simple you know so you think there's levels to this uh yes of course and you oh think yeah Carlos of course. is just on it obviously as the uncle and as a trainer as a fan yes. you think that he's on a different level you know what this uh, kid uh he's very smart he's very smart he's talented he's gifted he is um his body is just flexible he can do whatever you ask him to do you can ask him to do anything in the ring even if you haven't practiced that he will do it like that on the spot that's how good carlos is he is super super good i mean i can say you know what um i know he's young i know he's growing up however you know what he's got all the qualities he's got everything to become multiple champions multiple champion not only once multiple champion in different weight divisions mm -hmm. of course oh yeah it seemed like it was an easy decision like the common sense play for y'all would be go to oscar play to the play to your fan base why i'm, I'm not sure if you can answer this, but why would you guys go with richard Schaefer to al Heyman? that's kind of interesting because obviously i think he's going to be i think he might i don't know if he's going to be a superstar but i know at least he'll be a star carlos you understand what i'm saying exactly well see exactly and i respect that you know but i believe carlos not gonna be a star only he's gonna be a superstar mm -hmm. and that's the reason we put all this work that put in that's why we work every day because we believe that if i wouldn't believe that why am i gonna waste my time but i would no no i won't um i'm also uh, i'm also a high school teacher and, and oh, i need to be and i'm and i need to be at school every day but sometimes i, I take time off to go to the fights to go to the uh, training to go to the media workout to go like mm -hmm. everywhere so because we believe that because i believe he's gonna be a superstar yeah not only a star but a superstar yeah did you get a chance to meet jose ramirez he's in your area right jose yes he's in your area. He is like from, like two and a half hours away from okay. have you ever worked us? out with him trained with him not yet not okay. yet not yet they bite us once but uh we haven't we haven't trained with them okay well he's down here now he's at robert robert garcia now no oh, i see with robert garcia now how about the main event who do you like in the main event you know what i like michael garcia i think he's uh i think he's winning i think michael garcia is gonna take him yeah really yeah i, I think okay. so yes how about um uh deontay wilder uh anthony joshua how do you like that fight you know what um i'd love to watch that fight but i hear uh I think that fight is not happening anymore. I don't know. I was seeing, I was seeing something like that. Yeah. But um, I think I think Joshua. If that happens, I think Joshua is gonna. Do. Why Joshua? Why? I think he's uh, aggressive. I think uh, Wilder makes a few mistakes, and one of them is that uh, he starts throwing wild punches when when he gets tired, mm -hmm. and he needs to be very careful with that, especially with in in that level mm -hmm. of competition. You know? Okay. Fight just announced. Y'all may be fighting at 147 someday. Uh, Danny Garcia, Sean Porter. How do you like that one? Uh, I think Danny Garcia. Why? I think Danny Garcia. Interesting. Why? Why? Uh, I think he's got uh, a better technique. I think he's got a better um, skills. Mm -hmm. More skills. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay. And I think that's it. I appreciate you, King. Thank you. Thank you for your time, brother. Yeah. Where do you see you, yourself um, um, ending your career? What's up? Where do you yourself ending? How high do you want to go up, you say? I'm trying to be undisputed. Undisputed is a goal, but I'm going to be patient with it. Uh -huh. Capture a few world titles, move up and wait, and then move up and wait, and then move up and wait again. You've dreamed about this already. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure you've dreamed about the height of your success. Yes, sir. What is the height of your success, Carlos? The height of my success? Coming pound for pound, the best in the game. Don't doubt it. Zero doubt. Richard Schaefer can't stop talking about you, man. Yeah, man, with the future. I talk about heavyweights. He says Carlos Balderas. <laughs> <laughs>
Rambo right here. <laughs> next next audition for Rambo. Speaking of Mayweather, um, our classmates aren't eating this one. And they're the ones that are staying with them. Don't seem very happy. What are you talking about? I don't know nothing about that. That's why I signed the ring star. <laughs> <laughs> Joshua Wilder, how do you like that? Uh, Joshua, I go for Joshua. Why? Um, because he, I just like Joshua more. He's more legit. But you can't doubt Deontay Wilder's power, you know? Mm -hmm. One of those hits, you're going to sleep, but I'm going for Joshua. My money's on Joshua. Garcia Porter. Uh, Garcia. Garcia, but like, maybe ninth round knockout or something. Crawford. Yeah? Yeah, like, uh, No, no, no. Spence. Spence. <laughs> oh, you forgot your wallet. Too close to call. I'm graduating. Yeah, that's true. That's true. <laughs> nah, but I'm with you. I'm with Barrel Spence. My money's on Barrel Spence. You make some extra money that night. <laughs> You guys remember when Marquez and Israel and Marquez and Rafael Vasquez became champion on the same day? Yeah, you're watching this right now. Trust the process. Last time, I think I remember seeing two Mexican brothers in the bay with Marquez and Marquez and his brother, right? That's what me and my brother are aiming for, to becoming not just one, but becoming like a dynamic duo, you know, both of us, like the Charlos. Um, like, I feel like my brother is good. They sound like I'm in the gym training. And I'm tired as hell. But I see my brother going hard, so I go hard. Or even when we're running, he's trying to beat me, I'm trying to beat him. Me and my brother are very competitive, bro, and pretty much in everything we're gonna do. It doesn't matter if it's soccer or whatever it is, but my brother's gonna be on the opposite team because that's how competitive we are with each other, but we feed off that, you know? And yeah, we feed off each other's energy, bro. No, my grandpa is here. He's over there chilling. Oh, okay. yeah. My grandpa was actually in Mexico, bro. He just got back um, to the United States about two days ago. He was in Mexico doing some stuff. We had some, we had some family issues in Mexico, but my grandpa flew in and he came in and he's here. My grandpa's over there resting. Yeah, yeah, always. Number one.